Welcome to the round of 64 in the Crash Deck Tournament. GU Stakes event number three. This is the money bubble round, a very important round. Wanting to secure prizes in this tournament. We are going first. We have this deck against their deck. I actually like this draw. I'm just going to full keep. Keep in mind that Light doesn't really punish volatile imp super super easily because they don't have ping god power to kill it so we've got a turn one we've yeah we've got a very well besides vicious ren we've got a very good hand i'm gonna play this on one this on two and then figure things out from there interesting they played this and then didn't attack which to me makes no sense why would you not attack but in fact, it gives me the option to actually go face trade here and play a second imp, and I'm actually going to do that. We can serve our pip, which can be pretty useful. Also, these imp afterlifes combo very nicely with Vicious Rend. So, what our opponent did gave us options, and I guess they wanted to sneak that on the board. So, they were successful in that. I'll just go ahead and pass right now. No reason to attack both of these into here. So they're going to attack here into here most likely. Okay, so they're going to attack here, they're going to attack here. Interesting, they're going to take this out completely. No, they're going to gamble with a volatile imp and they, they nothing they did there made any sense. Unfortunately for us, we have a really bad hand. We can't play anything to expand upon our board situation. So all we can do is this, this, and this. Hopefully next turn we can make a Sanctum buy because this and this isn't very useful at the moment. All right. They play a Barricade, which is buffed, and a Wild Hog. So this hits here, and we can afford to grab this, which is key. So if this goes face, we can afford... Ah. Sanctum. You gotta be kidding me, Sanctum! It won't let me pick. You've got to be kidding me. I'm clicking everywhere. I'm literally clicking everywhere. This is complete BS. Because this is a big turn in the game. This is an absolutely big turn in the game. Because we need to buy this. Wow. That was huge, not being able to get that out there. Okay, so if we attack here to here, one of these hits here, we Vicious Rend, and then, yeah. Hopefully it hits here. Idiot! Idiot, idiot, idiot! That is so unlucky. Just gonna go with the GP here. So I can, I can kind of swing here. The thing is, is, they've got the healing minion, which is difficult. I want to save the pip for the Juggernaut. So we can Vicious Rend here if we want. Oh, this is, this is the key minion. I feel like we have to kill this minion, otherwise we get wrecked.
5, 8, 10. Actually going face is good here. So the reason why going face is a good plan is five puts them at seven. They would need a second one of these, even though, yeah, and we only need one to not heal face. And we've got the Slayer God power. We just need to hit the skill button every turn. I'm just so frustrated about that one turn. So we've got this as a surprise. They don't know this. So we're threatening lethal with just this and this. They're going to peel here, probably peel here, and then they're going to have th th a, couple of, a couple of minions. Okay. Probably going to buy this. We just need this to heal one of their minions and we win. Just heal here, heal here. Okay, excellent. So we're able to just do this. And okay, luckily that bug didn't cost, cost me. Okay, phew. Woo. Tune into game number two. We won game number one with war. So we can't play war anymore. We're queuing in with magic. They're sticking with light, which is what they played the previous game. We're going first, which we like. It's a full keep right there. <laughs> no, no, no decisions to be made. No decisions to be made. Staring at a hog and two axe woman. I'm gonna swing. Swing that keep all day. We're going to conserve our pip for later in the game. Most likely next turn, Axe Woman, potentially Illuminate, or just double Axe Woman. I mean, this is just ridiculous here. We peel their minion, and we're three wide already. Just off with a great start. We got Hunt Warden for next turn, so we're curved. Our opponent is up against the ropes. We can illuminate and play our own Hunt Warden here. Pretty easy decision on this turn. Just want to keep the early board initiative. This game, we're going to be the aggressors, obviously. We're going first, and we just want to... We have the initiative, and we just want to seize it as further. So the Sanctum is going to act as a second hand, because, again, we're getting a ridiculous amount of favor each turn. Okay, this guy, okay, they're going to value into here. So that hits there. Go ahead. I'll buy the rune here. I think it's the best card on the Sanctum. Could have argued buying this, or even this, because... We're ahead on the card drawing factory. This is probably just going to run into this, but it does slow them down. They can't value into here, and we can try this trade next turn. All right. So just trading off that minion... This is more expensive than the Rune of Fire, so we're just going to go ahead and play it. We are floating one, but this is reasonable. Just want to keep control of the board. We get the next Sanctum play, which is this next turn. I figure we might be more likely to need the one mana next turn. Opponent doesn't have a productive turn. They just GP and pass. All right, let's hit there. I want this, it adds to my board presence, and who doesn't like drawing cards? Okay, go ahead and toss this out there. So they'll, they can run into the barricade, but our GP can finish off here. We've just got a lot of pressure, and this is looking very good. That's just too slow. Yeah, that is definitely too slow. Almost have lethal. Not quite. Go ahead, GP face is the place, indeed. 
And a bridge assailant is super annoying in this situation. It's very big. Very good brawl this game. There's probably not much our opponent could do. Going first and getting three one drops in the opening hand is quite absurd in this format. Go ahead and get the win, and we advance to the next round. So we're in the money. That's good. 